Vultures are being poisoned to extinction. We must stop them from being wiped out. A catastrophe is taking place in Africa as thousands of vultures die of poisoning, gravely impacting the environment, wildlife and human health. The political animal lobby was alerted by South Africa's Endangered Wildlife Trust that there is a major problem for vultures in one of the world's greatest wildlife sanctuaries, the Kruger National Park. The news is bad. Not only did we find carcasses of critically endangered African whiteback vultures, but we found a poisoned tawny eagle and poisoned lions, leopards, civets and baboons. Vultures are prized for their heads and feet, which are used in traditional medicine, even though they have absolutely no medical benefits. To get the vultures, poachers kill other animals and lace the carcasses with poison. Vultures and other creatures die after feeding on these carcasses. The vultures do not die immediately, and that gives us hope. If we can get to them before they die and transport them for treatment, we can save many of them. We urgently need to raise $9,000 or £7,000 to build a special flatbed trailer equipped with cages so we can rush poison-stricken vultures for emergency medical treatment. Africa's vulture populations have plunged by 62% in the past 30 years, with seven species crashing by 80%. Without vultures, the risk of humans getting diseases explodes. When India misguidedly destroyed its vulture population, a catastrophic increase in rabies resulted. India is now trying to restore vultures to the wild with little success. If something isn't done right now to save the vulture from extinction, the world, and everyone in it, is in big, big trouble. The advantage of being a vulture is that they can eat diseases like rabies, tuberculosis, so they don't contract them. We know what's going to happen if we lose vultures. Deadly diseases will explode and humankind will face pandemic after pandemic, just like the coronavirus crisis. We can't stand idly by and watch this happen. We desperately need your help to save vultures and other creatures. So please, donate what you can today and we will do our part to make sure that vultures are around tomorrow and diseases are not.